heat maps. Heat map tools like Crazy Egg and Hotjar allow you to easily visualize complex statistical data. They show you one image that encapsulates everything you need to know about where visitors are clicking on your web page, what actions they are taking, how long they spend on your page, and with what content. This is great for discovering strong and weak points of your site and can also help you identify hard to navigate areas that you can change. Hotjar even allows you to play back live screen recordings of user behavior. These are called session recordings and are especially helpful if you want to understand how browsers really navigate your site. Session recordings let you see your website as your users see in their browser and record mouse movement, clicks and scrolling in real time. This helps you gain a greater understanding into your site visitors and can also help you identify weak spots and issues so you can improve the user experience. How do heat maps work? Heat maps use a warm to cool color spectrum to display your site analytics, highlighting the parts of your page that receive the most attention in red or orange. They can show you how far most people scroll down your page, allowing you to position your call to action where your visitors pay the most attention. Heat maps help you discover where to place your most important content by showing you your page's hotspots. They help you identify areas where browsers lose interest or fail to navigate your website correctly, allowing you to adjust these areas so you get better results. Heat maps also show you which content sits above the fold. This is the area of your website that people can easily see without having to scroll. It goes without saying that you should place your most important content here. There are four main types of heat maps you can use to help understand your visitor data better. Scroll maps. These show you how far down your page readers are scrolling and what they do when they get there. A great way to identify what is working on your page and what isn't. Click maps. Also known as touch heat maps, these allow you to see the individual clicks users make. Useful for highlighting problem areas, like where people are trying to navigate non-clickable elements. They also allow you to track custom parameters so you can see which of your campaigns are having the most success. Hotjar allows you to take click maps one step further with animated playable screen recordings so you can see in real time how your site visitors behave. Move maps. Move maps show where desktop users move and rest their mouse as they navigate your page. Hotspots highlighted in a move map show you where your users are pausing their mouse. Market research has found there is a link between where people look and where their mouse is. This makes move maps a great way to get an indication of what people are looking at on your website. Desktop and mobile heat maps. These allow you to compare the performance of your website across different devices. Content that displays prominently on a desktop might well sit below the fold on a mobile device, and if so, user interaction and actions may differ. These type of heat maps help you see if this is the case so you can make the required changes to ensure both desktop and mobile browsers can easily interact and view your content. Three great ways you can use heat maps to boost your brand and drive conversions. Content marketing. You can use scroll maps to show you how far down the page users scroll, giving you a great insight into how much of your content they're reading. This is an ultra efficient technique you can use to assess the performance of blog posts, sales copy, and other content. Max the effect by combining them with click maps to track what content provides the most customer conversions. Website redesign. Heat map technology can be really helpful when redesigning your site. Run a map before and after your redesign to compare your user stats and see if your new site performs better than the old one. A slash B testing. Heat maps are invaluable for testing out different versions of your website or landing page as they let you quickly see which one performs better. With them, you can see exactly what your visitors do differently on different versions of your pages. You can use them to test out individual changes like moving your call to action button, or you can test entirely different versions of your page to see which one converts more effectively. If you're interested in better understanding your audience through data and analytics, you should definitely incorporate heat map technology into your marketing approach. With so many useful insights, they can give you a new perspective into your data 
allowing you to tweak your site so it's optimized for browsers and positioned to encourage conversions and signups.